Life is Strange, True Colors, Episode 5. Final episode, last time we uh, got shoved out to the middle of nowhere. And uh, you can see for yourself in uh, the YouTube video. That was obviously the video before. Welcome and now there's a side B. So we're back here. Do you want to talk about your time in Colorado? Yeah, it was great. I love that time. Let's start with something positive. What did you learn from your visit to Haven Springs? Nothing. I learned to let myself feel, I guess. And to not be afraid oh, of- Oh, we're alive. But like I said, there's another episode. Someone argue that those old we're not dead. Out to be justified? Oh, not anymore, that's the final one. What? Do you make of that friction? That type of friction? No, that's way too early in the video to get demonetized. <laughs> I suppose I'm proud of you for trying. You helped some people. Wasn't me. Taste a mystery. Hello, mouse. My mouse on. Oh yeah, it is. God, not reload really last checkpoint. Oh yeah, I did that. I, I... But Alex... Good to go. You're right back where you started. I want that mouse. Deep eyes off. You're wrong. You're wrong. I don't belong in here. If that were true, Alex, you'd know you were talking to an empty chair. Yeah, well, maybe you are an empty chair. I fucking called it. <laughs> I called it. Like I said, long episode, I'm kind of like losing my memory in this game at this point. What the fuck? Can I? Nope. I want to look at my folder first. I'm wearing the same top as I did at, um, at the very end. I guess that's me. Case number 53322. Hello, I am number. Emotional instability, occasional violent outbursts, hallucinations, visual, hallucination, oral, delusional ideation, and depression, anxiety, diagnosis, fuck knows. Apparently I'm 21 years old and a female. I am neither of them. I'm 19 and I've got a penis. Twelve years ago, I made a mistake. Ooh. It's the kind of thing that you you can't undo. Alex, you know that I care about you. With everything that has happened, I just want what's best for you. No, you don't. I just want a, a brick wall. Oh, I've got pictures on here. The picture that me and Gabe had. Please far left. Don't belong them, them to Dr. Lin. And the other one, I don't know what that picture was. I didn't get to see it longer. Tuning peg. Oh, off the guitar. Phone. Guitar on my hand. No, positive. Our best resisted. Oh. The guitar case. Oh, it's still got the. Oh. The guitar. Knock, knock. See? Oh. I was going to say, like, knock, knock is. And get out of the room and continue playing the game instead of fiddling around with things, but. Oh. Um. Alex Chen? I'm Alex Chen, who? My guitar case has never heard of me. Sure. Huh. Me on town doors and be like. Six six three two two. I think that's the case number.
No. I don't think that's right. No. Shit. I don't think that's right. I oh, it's five. Was... Case number. Not six. Three, three, two, two. <clears throat> For the most part, I remember numbers. It doesn't help my case, and um, I'm not going to say. Let's play it. The hell? Can't play if I can't tune. See, now we look at the picture that looks like it's in this. On the filing cabinet. What do we guess? On the desk, but uh no that definitely looks like a sofa. But also you can play if it's not tuned. Just saying. Won't sound good. I should make sure I look at everything first. Is that what I look like? Really? No. Well, I swear the wall just changed colour. I swear. It's gonna be locked. Of course. Close enough locked. Not getting out that way. There's like nothing else I can do. Gabe gave me this guitar. But he never heard me play it. Cause I opened this, I read everything. Down. Oh. What? I didn't realize. Uh, you know, she's able to read other people's emotional states and believes that because of this ability she is uniquely equipped to help others overcome their own emotional trauma. It's difficult to overlook the irony. Someone as profoundly dysfunctional as Alex, adopting the role of emotional caretaker. Had she not been returned to my care, I do not think it hyperbolic to speculate that her vector attempts at fixing her friends and family would eventually have gone somewhere her. It's my belief that Alex's delusions constitute a threat to her continued well-being as well as those of others. As such, I recommend Alex be thrown down an endless pit, her body shared against each jutting board. Episode 4. Look. Endless pit? Shattered against each jutting board? That, that's literally the, the mind shaft we went down. This is, in my professional opinion, the most humane thing we can do for her. Um, the, the, the I, that there is nothing I can do. I've already looked. Please, don't. Oh, take. <laughs> That's the thing I need to do. Now we're gonna put this back in. We're just gonna ram it in there and I hope it works. Just one of those screwy ones. Fair enough. I thought you might need something to put it in, but like a special tool. Hi, I'm a special tool. I can control Ow as well. Who? Oh. Well, that's not good. Oh, it's starting to come back. I survived that. See, guys, I told you, she's not dead. There's another episode. Uh, 
Oh, I got Donald Trumped. It just clipped me, so I'm alive. Oh. That board ain't lasting long. Ooh, a ladder. <laughs> Obviously, I got it to, like, the side of the head instead of the ear, but it's close enough. Was I meant to do something there, or was that just the game? I think it was just the game. I mean, close. It's the same area. I need got shot on the right-hand side, and she had the mark on the right-hand side. They predicted. They, they predicted it. Well, it's not exactly. Alex. Oh, hey. Not exactly hard to do. Gabe? <gasps> You're dead. So am I now. So? Lots of people are dead, Alex. Most people. Where are we? I want to say... a hospital? Dr. Mendez to intensive care. Dr. Mendez to intensive care. Yep, definitely a hospital. <laughs> Gabe. Okay, here's what I do know. You are 10, I am 14. Our mother is sick. So is our father. But it's a different kind of sickness. Yeah, putting out with both of us. Yay, got him. Play your part. Ow! Is this some I sick kind of fetish? I didn't do anything. Stop. Both of you. Dad. Hey. Behave. <laughs> That's probably a weird thing for me to say, but... Uh... Ooh, look, we're role-playing. Alex, go check on your mother. Okay. Ooh, are they going to talk about the things behind our back? What do you think his name is? I think his name's John. She's not here. She was right over there, waiting for me. Ooh, 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 ooh. Achievement. Used to fidget with her keys whenever she was worried. Yeah, well, I don't care. Achievement. Gabe, Alex, I need you to listen very carefully. We got some scary news today, and I'm going to be spending some time at the hospital. What? Mom, are you okay? Hush now. It's going to be okay. Do you understand me? There's a pendant as well, I know this. Different. For a little while. Gabe told me it was full of needles. It scared me to death. Probably in here. Open. Yeah, it'll be in there, surely. Hey. Yeah, that can't be blood pressure. That can't be BPM. <laughs> yeah, that's saying about 72, 3. The fuck was the other one? What's the other screen? I said 8. Maybe breaths, maybe. That's overnight bag. They wouldn't put two right next to each other, would they? Ooh, tissues. There's something so weird and scary about watching your dad cry. Oh, there's the blood pressure. 62 over 41. Yeah. If. If. Hi, Mom. Hi. Can you hear me? Hi. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't realize you were allergic to me. Mom. Such a 
brave girl. How do you ever get so brave? Is that how it went? You don't think you missed anything? You have a suspended. Gabe, why? I didn't do anything. Stop. Both of you. Dad. Behave. Can check on your mother? Yeah, I wonder what his name is. Is it John? Can't tell. Go check on your mother. Can't tell. Okay. Oh, maybe my webcam blocks his name. Not in that angle, just then. Maybe we go back and depend on there? Wait. Did I miss something? No matter how much Mom drank, her throat was always dry. She knew. And that pussy. Even then, she knew. We spent so much time in here that I basically couldn't afford a private room. Just got lucky. There it is. The painting that taught me that art sucked sometimes. Who TV? And I used to watch cartoons on this thing after school. Can I go in here? I don't know where to turn up, but can I look at everything in here? It was always fun. too hot in this room. She's just on the other side. Hang on a minute. Fan is blowing where? Into the curtain, and the curtain's not moving. I've already looked around, there's no pendant. Actually, I'm just gonna have a look around like this. I not see anything. How many nights did Dad spend in this room? There's something so weird and scary. Yeah, these are literally just the exact same. What am I missing? What did we talk about? Can I not? Hi, Mom. How can I order on her? Hi. <coughs> Mom. Mom. See, this is different now. Water, Alex. Get her some water. <laughs> no, she's not wearing a pendant. Just let her die. I'm joking. <coughs> hey, suck on this. Was me. You almost never cried, even when you were very small. Did you know that? No, because I was That's fucking tiny. My biggest challenge with you. How do you take care of someone who is already so? I don't like whatever just went through her. Shh. No tears, my strong girl. She looks angry there. How dare you, Clay? I want you to make me a promise. No. Nah. -uh. Mm. No. Your brother. Mm -mm. Your father. They are going to need you. You have to be strong. Will you do that, 
Molex. No. I play with Toy Con instead. <laughs> Such a brave girl. How do you ever get so brave? Wow. <laughs> Bye then. Guys, can you tell me she's sad? I can't tell. She's still alive. Well, maybe no. <laughs> Let me see a bitch face. Yeah, Hannah. There, is that what you wanted? Oh, she stopped crying. It's on the verge of it. Yeah, you suck. Sorry, it clearly didn't work. Where am I? Oh, this would be the. Yeah, of course. Where's all beds? Yeah, beds are overrated. You don't need a bed. God, his head looks like a fucking... What's it called? Um... The, like... The vegetable. The, the, the long thing. I can't remember what it's called. It's, it's the white... Oval. I could just say a fucking rugby ball at this point, but... Squash thingy. Was that the last time you talked to her? I can't remember. What do you want? Can I throw a shoe at him? I. The fucking. I'm cooling it. I think so. Do you miss her? Gabe, what's going on? You're 11, I'm almost 15. Dad and I are time bombs. You keep running back and forth, trying to defuse us both. But I'm not squash, that's it. This is going to suck so bad. His head looks like one of these. <laughs> Play your part. I knew it had squash in the name. I just couldn't remember what, what it was called. So I did Google squash vegetable and then it popped up. <laughs> I'm not wrong though. Maybe not the like fat on the bottom then curves in then back out. But it's definitely like as wide as one. So pretty much more for rug people. Jungle. American football ball either. Or American football. Or rugby. There was only ever one thing to do. This slaps. Oh, it's because she's putting a headset with it. Headset? Headphones. Headset. Headphones. Okay, here it looks normal, but in the picture, I swear he had a rugby ball head. I swear. Come on! This is what he just said. <laughs> Maybe not that far. Hey. It's okay. It's just me. But you know that's not how it went down, right? Yeah. 
you got a shotgun out. Fella. Just give me enough time to uh, just walk around, please, please. It was my job to keep the peace. But no matter what I did. I'm just seeing if there's anything. I don't, yeah, I can't go upstairs. Can, I can go in there. Ooh. Find the business call memory in chapter five. Hey Gabe, I'm Leslie Halloran. I'm from the Oregon State Child Protective Services. Oh. We got a call from someone who said there might have been some kind of fight here last night. Is your dad home? Oh gosh, you know what? We were, yeah, that was like um, rehearsal. And I'm in this play at school, and my dad, like, he was um, helping me learn my lines. Must be some play. But if you need anything, my number is on there. Okay? Price cook up. I thought that'd be something, yeah. Alright, so obviously I killed them, or there's someone else. Woo! I tried so hard to keep my promise to her. Well, keeping them the same. Definitely fucking did that. Alright, if it wasn't a record player, maybe it... I do just listen to the record player again. Because it was like before... It wasn't me who did something wrong, it's... What popped up in the game. It was like... You thought it was this, but actually it was this. So I think this is the exact same. Oh no, this is just one of these things. Okay, so it is something else. It isn't the music we put on our ears, it's something else in the room. Alright. Can I... Comic? Like, TV? No. Mom and Dad had this TV before they had either of us. So it has to be the comic book. Son of lead back when it was an indie. It was too gory for the killer mistress tabs in this book. Weren't even close to right. Cleaning dad's ashtray was not my favorite job in the world. Fucking pissy, I don't know what you're on about. Mom's old sewing Cookie kit. Tin. Don't think I've ever even tasted a <laughs> it, it, it like a biscuit tin. I wanted to be aware that sounds about right. My job was to sort them in order of how close we were to a collect- It was full of greeting cards. Thanks for trying, lucky cat. I think I checked this corner. There's nothing there. Uh... Dad's laundry. At least I managed to hold on to you, Shu Shu. Ken. No, we already looked at this. No offense to the mama, but we're already locked. I promise to her. I wanted to look at record player. Probably the most expensive thing we owned. It kind of kept me sane. Well, that box TV, Jesus. Gabe had barely used this backpack in weeks. Oh, maybe I went in to try and. Where are you going? Are you gonna tell her, or is that my job? Keep your voice down. Fine, I'll do it. Alex, dad lost his job again. So we're broke again. Don't talk to me that way. Despite what you may believe, you do not know everything. What up, boys? I laid myself off. It's okay. We'll figure it out. I've been 20 months in a row. But what are we supposed to By the time this video goes out, it'll probably be 30. We can sell some records. Or, or what about my guitar? We can sell that. Alex. What is it going to take to get you to stop defending him? If your mother could see you now. I don't want to hear about mom. Gabe! <laughs> I'm so tired of you using her as an excuse to be a piece of shit. <laughs> don't fucking touch me, piece of shit. Dad. <gasps> Ow. Damn it. Alex. I'm okay. It's okay. It was an accident. You went to swing it back in a... Elbowed me. I, I didn't. Dad, Dad, it's okay. Really. He already left chat, by the way. 
You've already stopped and fucked off. Apparently, you said the bot. I can't do this. <laughs> oh no, wait, 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 me? Dad? You said you left the fucking chat, but you're here. What? What's this? All the drunks? Someone will come. That woman from CPS. Someone. He got up and left. And then CPS bounced about. Got it. Dad. I'm sorry. He literally got the fucking milk. No. Uh, no. You know, that's not how it actually went. Oh, you twat. So basically, we're finding him to get a bank. Got it. I don't think I've played this episode. I, I don't recognise it at all. See, his name was John. Knew it. I could tell by the name on his shirt. Hey, can I ask you a question? No. Which orphanage is this? The one in Grant Park? Kind of thought it'd be nicer. I can't do this, okay? I. I can't. You need to. No. You need to be honest about what you see. I was. I have. Well, about what I see. Well, we now see the exact same. Almost. But not yet. You are 12. I am 16. I steal a car and end up in juvie. Gabe, come on. Then you're 13, 14, 15. Orphanages, group homes, must see rooms in the strange houses of foster parents. By the time you're 17, you've seen them all. It's a flashback, so that's why. She's 21 at this point. Things. Your own emotions don't belong to you. You have nothing. No one. You are alone. I don't want this. <laughs> what do you mean he still left the fucking chat? Play your part. <sighs> fucking arms on those DMs as well. Um, ooh. Memory. I don't understand. Why can't I have my guitar? We've been over this, Alex. Your guitar stays in the rec room. You can play it during free time. That's bullshit. I don't need it in the fucking rec room. I need it when I'm stuck in the fucking dorms. Alex, that's enough. Maybe we'll just take away your guitar privileges entirely, if that's what you prefer. You can't do that. Well, apparently they can, and they will. Ah, Foot Locker. That's a shop. Also, you can fit many feet in that. Just saying. 
you see, it isn't actually how it went out. That time's a charm. Oh. She's been through so much. I just don't know if we're prepared for a troubled girl. It says here she's sensitive. What is that? Oh, Angie. I wonder why she's never found a home before. So that's why you're angry. Okay. Not the others. Oh, she's scared. I'm sure she's a sweet girl, but she's not for us. She's awfully old, isn't she? This is the kid that's been in all those fights, right? <laughs> I want to help. I, I really do. But there's just something off. Broken. Wrong. With her. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, well, you don't want to put your hand there, love. But then again, it is fake glass. Because it's not even real. So she's fine. See how he it made glass noises, but he wasn't even stepping on glass there. Why? You need to see it. See what? That nobody picked me? Nobody picked you. Get in. Nobody picked you. Nobody wanted you. Mom. Hey, story of my life. Dad left. I bailed. Oh. You couldn't keep us together. It was my job to keep us. You were 11 years old. You were 11 years old. You were a kid, Alex. Let it go. People leave. Life gets hard. Sometimes. Sometimes it's a big shit sandwich. It's a big shit sandwich. Get better. Be angry at dad. Miss mom. Hell, be angry at me. But don't give up. No one gets to tell you what you're worth. And no one can take your life away. Fight. I'm no one can sure take your life away. You gift. Get shot in the head. It's something you don't even understand. Okay. Closely. Just barely missing an assassination. Like someone else. What's the announcement? Shut up! Change the world. Canceling. Make it better. Now get up. What? Get up and fight. No one fucking asked her. <laughs> what the fuck did she want? Ouch. Yeah. And this is present day. We've made it to the bottom, to be fair. Um, and we've pretty much got a bank storm to her now. What's that? Is that a ticking bomb? A grenade? No, I think that's just water. Oh shit, the pendant. Oh, or that. Oh, it's not a fucking bowl of water, it's a... a torch. Oh, look who it is. Full flamps, something. 
both give light. Technically a candle. Because you're lighting it with fire. It's a candle. What can I say? Give good wood sometimes. Sometimes. Not when it's floppy. <laughs> I was going to say something then, but um, I'm not even going to comment. out of here. Yeah, no shit. Nim, 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 nim. Ooh, dead rat. We can eat that. Protein. I'm gonna ah. choose not to read anything into this. Why is there no eat button? <laughs> is it safety first? Ooh, pickaxe. Mining oh, away. Down here. Oh no. At least I can have a cigarette while I'm here. This is a big hole. Last time I saw a hole this big was your mother's house. I was in bed with her. That don't sound good. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Come on, no, 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 no. <laughs> That sounded more like gas. It's like leaking. I can do this. You definitely can. It's what I hear when I watch porno. It's what I see as well. Close my eyes. Envision it. I'm joking. No, I don't need to watch that when I get pictures off your dad. That aura is the only lead I've got. I'm just saying if there's anything about. I'm still very much bleeding out. Exactly. All right, boys, getting close. Well, I do as well. Hell divers for life, huh, Jed? Hell divers, look, look, look. They predicted it. Hell diver. Hell, hell divers do. They predicted the game God before it came wrong. out. This is it. This is what Typhon tried to bury. A lot of enough moisture in this soil, Jed. We gotta call it. This stick is fucked. Nothing's fucked. Jed, we got no pumps running. No, my teams have never quit a dick this deep before. We finish the job. Um, so he must have used to work Steady for Typha then. Steady. Wait. Fuck was... Move! Come on! Clear the tunnel! Is this when he We're drank people here. out? Jed! Fuck! Jed! Or... The explosion. We gotta move now. There's still men back there. Because that sounds more like no, yes. they'll drown. It must be water. We don't get the fuck out. Make the call, Jed. God damn it. Where? God damn it. Everyone, let's go now. I just wiggled my way to the uh, checkpoint. Eh? Smells like fireworks. Must be where Typhon blew the charges. Well. What's that? This doesn't seem safe in the slightest. I won't lie. Stick my hand down a crack that looks like water. Not water, fire. Same thing. 
pendant. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Can I? Dad. Can I? Right click, please. New memory unlocked. There it is. That's the one I was looking for. So pretty much. Dad, Point five percent of people. Dad, you son of a who play this game. I haven't got from here to the end of the game. Wait. Dad, you gotta stop, man. Wait. It's over, Jen. He's not coming back. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. So he moved here to mine. Gabe came out of Juvie, found out where he lives, then moved here. Or at least where he used to live. Because he died in the mines, and I think that was way before everything. And it should take us back to the, the Typhon bit? Yeah, this bit. I can't remember what it's called, but the bit where we were before, when looking for Ethan. We're going to walk into Haven and people are going to be like, what the fuck happened to you? Well, as you see. As you see. Yeah, 2008. This must have been whilst Gabe was in Juvie, surely. So it must... Gabe must have figured it out, then moved here after he knew he was dead. Surely. That's the only explanation I can give from this. And obviously we figured out where Gabe lived and we ended up coming here. Close for council meeting. And during my time here, I've come to realize what makes Haven so special. It's a flower shop run by multiple generations. A bar owner who greets Every customer by name. I'll choose them. It's a spring <laughs> festival tradition going back a hundred years. History. Loyalty, How would you know that? I mean, pride. Ducky and Jed probably would. These they look values it. which define Haven are the same values that Typhon was built on. Surely, or no? E has been so successful. It's been my privilege to renew Typhon's commitment to Haven. We believe in this community, and we're tremendously excited for its future. I have a feeling why Jed betrayed us there. I have a feeling because he wants the money from Typhon to come through and keep uh, Haven going, and he's so loyal to Haven that he'd rather have someone obviously fall down a mine and fucking die because he got shot instead of losing out the Typhon money, where they actually have billions. Thank you, Diane. I think I speak for all of us when I say we're eager to make this official. And maybe they're expanding it, look. Time to vote, folks. And then lunch. I, I don't know what that map is. <sighs> hey! I've got a... I've got a limp here. Hey. Alex, oh my God. I'm fine. You are not fine. We have to get you to a doctor. What happened to you? This will be hard to hear. I found out something you need to hear. I'm sorry. What? Your dad? Alex, you're hurt. It is an attempted murderer. You can you can see like here where Do Grace. Help? We can call an ambulance. Typhon's been lying to all of you, and so has Jed Lucan. Oh, Alex, 
What's going on? Fuck you. Fuck you. What probably not the, the hell happened? Probably not the best. <laughs> I was down in the mine last night. I saw what Typhon's been hiding for 12 years. Jed Lucan isn't a hero. That whole story is a lie. Jed caused the accident. And then he abandoned seven of his men. He let them drown to save himself. There were pictures of me and Gabe down there in the dirt. Because one of those miners was my father. Hold up. Miners? Don't any mind, Chris Romina. Typhon wanted to keep this covered up in case it jeopardized the vote. They're very close. All they care about is making more money. They'll do whatever it takes to push this expansion through. So they decided to bury the evidence. And nothing was going to stop that blast. Not even the fact that there were four people up in the mountains. That's how Gabe was killed. Jed knew all along. He covered up the truth about the past, about Gabe. And when I found out, as you can see, he tried to kill me too. Uh, no, no you didn't. No, 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 I didn't. Take him into question, man. Do it. Why aren't any of you saying anything? We don't want to embarrass you, Alex. Didn't ask you. I wasn't asking you. The things you've said obligate me to at least address them. These accusations are... Well, they're insane. And trying to go into the mine was obviously a very dangerous, very illegal thing to do. I shouldn't go into the mine. But we all sympathize with your situation. You've been through so much. Your brother was your only family, wasn't he? I can only imagine how much you want an explanation. Please give me the option to smack up, please, please, please. I'm not going to do it. Comfort and make your life seem good. less unfair. Good or not. You suppress evidence. You know there's proof of the cover-up. You had Pike arrest me to suppress the evidence. Officer Pike arrested you for stealing items from my purse. Perhaps you were looking for evidence? And I found it. Which is why you and Jed tried to threaten me into silence. Dad? Do you have any idea what Alex is talking about? No, not at all. No. I don't. I've tried to be there for Alex since Gabe died. I thought... I don't know. I hoped I could be something of a father figure to her. Look at this. All I can guess is, sometimes when we're hurting, the people we lash out at are the ones who are trying to help. Pretty much. This is an act. You're lying. Please. I know this is hard to accept. You all trust him. I did too, but I'm telling the truth. I believe you. Of course I do. But look at the fucking gash on my head. I believe you too. Come on, Shiana. I thought my name was Rebecca, to be I'm honest. Horrified. And shocked and still processing everything, but I believe you. That's two. He's gonna be stuck between me and him, but Ms. Harmon, please remember the terms of your settlement. Oh. My son and I are relying on that money. Then you should know that a public change of stance will nullify the agreement. No, you twat.
I would like to speak. Thanks. I've known Jed a very, very long time. No, oh, fuck. Miss Jen? Alex? I'm realizing I don't quite know you as well as I thought. Some allowances must, of course, be made given your injuries and resultant confusion. But nonetheless, it saddens me to hear you make these terrible and incredible accusations against my friend. I've always found Alex to be a very trustworthy person. Surely Punk says something. She wouldn't make these accusations lightly. Something must have happened. Miss Lath, there's no actual evidence of anything. Bullshit. Pike, not, stand up. But that's what I think. Speak to the juror now. Stand up and call. Go on, go on, go on, go on. Actually, Diane, there is evidence. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Dickhead. A USB stick full of recordings. Yes. We went through this yesterday. Your superiors closed the case. None of us have time for conspiracies. Yeah. You're trying to weasel your way out of things again, huh? I know your game. I know Don't how you... test me, Jason. Pulls out a gun. <laughs> you know what? I'm not scared of you anymore. And not of you. Not Typhon. All right, that's enough. Deputy Pike, do you have some kind of personal issue with me? Yes. Hell I do. Jason. Well, given that your judgment in this matter is emotionally compromised, you should probably remove yourself. Oh, my job here is done. Can we go to the hospital now? It concerns me that a voting member of the leave. Okay. This is a load of bullshit. <laughs> I don't this is getting this. ridiculous. We're all getting ahead of ourselves. And I'm so sorry. I'm going first oh, you can't. Dad. Please. Come clean. We'll figure it out together. It amazes me. The extent to which she has manipulated you. So tell us what she's. Dad. He said she has. Never in a million years. Come on. I hate seeing you do this. My own son. Dad. My own goddamn son! That's better. Oh. What's happening here? Wrong. Wrong. Good crank or something? Jesus. I know why you tried to kill me. It's not what you tell yourself. That you thought it was best for Haven. That's what I said. It was never about Haven at all, was it's it? It's about the Typhon money. This was about you. All that, yeah. I know it's easier. Not having to think about the men you buried. You want to look away and pretend the people you hurt aren't people. The way it glimpsed, mean? like, down for a minute. Guilty. I mean, we know he is, but... My father worked for you. His name was John. I want to say he was a screw up, but... The world never gave a shit about him. He was always struggling just to get by. He still hoped one day things would be better. But you killed him. Slowly picking off them off one by one. And then Gabe, my big brother. Being a family. He was building a family here, doing it his own way, figuring it out as he went along. 
he was so nervous about it. And so excited. And he brought me here to be part of that family. But he oh. died. Because of you. Yeah, look how his eyes are slightly glitching. Not glitching, but like twitching left and right. And then there's me. I'm just proves he's. So many years, I just wanted you know, to survive. Guilty as shit. To get through. Haven changed me. I started to think about the future. Playing on stage yesterday. It's one of the best moments I can remember. Gabe knew that about me. He knew that if I could just play, just let myself love something, then one day I could be happy. Mm. And you tried to murder me. You would have ended my life just so you wouldn't have to face the truth. Yeah, see. No words, but his actions. Good looking. We're asking you on suspicion about it. Haven't you? You've plastered over it with Yeah, he story. does. You tell yourself. You're a hero. A strong leader. I mean, that's not what he says, but that's what everyone says about Sometimes him, which kind of makes him think about it. Hard choices. Decisions that could lead to people dying. Few men could handle that. Haven's lucky to have you. But that's the lie. If you scrape it away, what do we see? Nothing. You're a pawn. <laughs> uh, no, no coward. Eleven years ago, you led a group of men to their deaths. And you couldn't even say those words out loud. Oh no, whilst they were in, um... Because you're a coward. He must have... So the, the dad must have left, saying it to your wife. and they must have died whilst he, they were in the orphanage. In front of your son, because the thing is, when she was eleven, he went to juvie Day or twelve. Enough to go underground. Eleven or twelve. In the eye. And she's twenty-one at this point, she so eleven years back. Courage to admit a mistake. She was ten, so it must be when she was in the orphanage. He went here and died. Are you trying to pull away? Don't. The truth hurts. That's what I say. Sometimes it's so awful you think you're gonna break. But when you come out the other side and you're whole and free and still alive, then you'll finally know how strong you really are. This sounds like some quotes here, won't I? And I'm finished. I see the truth about you. Never mind, not yet. You hate yourself. Hey, same. <laughs> you hate what you did in the past. You hate what you've done to keep it secret. And the more you deny that hatred, the worse it grows. The worse it grows, it doesn't grow at all. <laughs> I know who you are. I've seen the worst parts of you. Whoa! Do you see that? His entire beard went all... And I condemn you. I'm not gonna say I forgive you. You can fuck off. You can tell the look on his face when I walked in as well. <laughs> like Professor's man. That 
That can't be it. There needs to be some form of resting here. Oh, we're back to the music, which means I'm going to get copyright claimed for this. Even though I'm literally in my own room. Oh, hello. Glad of you to uh, join us. And the news is still coming in on the type in mining scandal that has rocked the western slope town of Haven Springs, where a council meeting was the scene for shocking revelations. Oh, no, no, the final blood. Council President Jed Lucan admitted in a tearful confession to covering up the deaths of seven Typhon employees as their manager 12 years ago. Boom. A recent cover-up, which involved a clandestine and unpermitted explosion to thwart inspections, caused the death of Haven local Gabe Chen last month. Mr. Lucan is currently Bang. in police custody, awaiting arraignment. We will have plenty more about this developing story, Same. including the resignation of Typhon CEO, the market impact, and what oh. all needs for your drive time commute coming right. What a shot! Yeah, the silence is worse. I need to get some air. Silence always treats me better. After summoning all my strength <laughs> and willpower. I'm now ready to move from the bed to the Ooh. rooftop. Pendant. That doesn't sound good. Oh my god, my continued support for you. The post is disabled replies. That is wild. Do I need a Charlotte Harmon portrait? I kind of hmm. think I need a Charlotte Harmon portrait. The phrase recent events is Ooh. doing some work and it never ends. Prison community is concerned, she tells the still emerging, and we are combined with the state police. We can only have as much information as any of you. The police have tapped W. Jason Punk to provide assistance in this case, and as such, management of this account has been handed over to another deputy. But we are going to W. Punk has come to occupy a special role in the Human Spring Community, where she has direct all inquiries through official channels. Yeah, I didn't know. Hello. Hmm. Town council vote. It's like all happy stuff. And then the next one is, yeah, we're, we're remaining closed for the foreseeable. Actually, my phone has blown up. Who's this bitch? Uh, some bitch. What does he want? I got a mag even message. I should take down time and thank you. Ducky lost for words. Amazing. I'm totally sorry. I don't know what else to say. Do one. What happened? You weren't going to mention being a superhero when I texted you yesterday. I'm so glad you're safe. Ugh. Who's this bitch? Oh, of course, another one of them. New York to the ground. We want your story. Nope. This call has been blocked. You will no longer receive messages. I like it. There's no uh, okay as soon as you can, I'm pretty sure I'm figuring out. I just stopped replying to people. Damn straight. Head up to the roof. Beforehand. I th I should gonna say I think I've got everything. All the memories in this blood out. Mr Chen. John. And no. Oh. I'm a hard worker. I've got him! This is the and first ever chapter in this game that I've got everything. You don't have somebody waiting on you at home? No, sir. Well, John, guess you're a hell diver now. Still looking out for me. I'm in Jed's house. I want everything I thought you ought to have it. Thank you. I've got a shark sculpture, what the fuck, that's a bit weird. I thought before I got upstairs, I'll just check this room in case there's a memory. 
just in case. That's going to be one of them too, isn't it? Or Pike, actually. Could be Sean. Hey, but... Steph. See, Alex, I knew it. Wait. Before you say anything, I have to get this out. Okay. Hurry up. What you did at the council meeting, it was the bravest thing I've ever seen. And it made me want to be brave too. So, here it goes. I want to be with you. I don't give a shit about playing music or seeing the world. I mean, I do, but only if it's with you. And if you'd rather stay here instead, then... No. Fuck it. <laughs> I want to stay here too. You ripped your bus ticket. I can get another one. Or not. It, it doesn't matter. Point is, I'm in. For whatever you want. Get on the bed right now. Make it our second time with uh, bedrocks. Uh, giving me a lot to think about. In life is strange, it is. Well, good. <laughs> that was the idea. I think ep uh, two, episode three, you I think it was. Me. Maybe. I can't remember. Good luck, Chen. Thanks, Steph. Boats old and new, uh, or new and used. Remember Triport? How about you remember Triport? There, it's added to my collection of wine either sink. See how easy that was to put on a pile what I'm taking with me because I haven't packed my bag yet. Ticket stall? On my phone. All right. Just tell me. Oh, what? hello. My future. What to do? Go over there. The night of the Spring Fest, Steph made a strong push for leaving with her. Playing on the road. The excitement of the unknown. I feel like double exposure might nice. tie in with... That was before this. all the shit went down. <laughs> Come on, you're the know-it-all. So I tell think. Me. Actually, I do know what you should do. Get away from me. You should stay in Haven. Oh. Ready? You really think so? Of course. You finally have a home. A job? People who actually like you? Why would you give that up? That's true. Or... We could. Then again, maybe leaving would be better. Have a house here. What? But tall. You're young, you suddenly have a little money, friends. And don't you think it's time to give this music thing a real shot? No, you should definitely leave. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> Stop it, Gabe. I don't need the mysterious spirit bullshit right now. I just need... I just need my big What's brother. What's email? Oh, something I unsubscribed to ages ago, but Sorry. still was sending me emails. I know. Hello. But here's something. A bear. It's three hours from now. A bus pulls away. There's definitely music at the back of this. You're not on it. And neither is Steph. Oh. Life goes on. So I don't even get the decision, it's the game that makes the decision. Got it. 
Oh yeah, we're doing this music. Get a job working with Steph at the record store. Ah, and so the pump I work here, and I'm guessing I still have that floor in the air. Uh... All those years of being a music snob finally pay off. In the back mountain. Yeah, me too. I would have just said fucking leave. And little by little. Time does its thing. I mean, time does its thing. Oh, that was just a really long pause. Feel less like a museum and more like a home. Okay, so obviously he's growing up at this point. Although these loading screens are taking way too long. Thoughts of Jed. Ooh. Of Typhon. Even of me. Begin to fade into the background. So it still like the local pub now, but without any of that. Community around establishment. Nice. Instead of a pig fucking rifle up there. Right he's back. And with a new fella it seems. Hmm. I mean actually should. Sure of finding a new guy. I mean, to be fair, it's about time, right? What's that? Just some folio shots gonna turn into a hat. That just turns into nothing. That hat turns into a cowboy hat. And Eleanor finds herself. Ooh, D20. She finds herself still as she was. What do you want? Hmm, hmm, hmm. What do you want? I don't know if I'm saying they've got married already. Or was that just a casual ring? The rooftop is your stage. It's on the fucking ring finger, though. You perform every week. To a small but adoring group of fans. Just saying. Oh, but then again, a small <laughs> group of fans. When you play, you wonder what could have been. Performing for more people in more cities, sharing your music with the world. She is currently strumming the exact same chord, may I add. Or maybe you never think about that much at all. The end of that it looked like she moved to the you key. I don't know exactly when it happens. But one day you look around and find that you have transformed this place just, just as, as much, much as it has as transformed, transformed you. you. And the most extraordinary thing of all is just how normal it feels. Well, I'll tell you how normal it feels. I'm gonna step on the end of his penis. You don't doubt it? I wonder what might have been. It's your life. The life you think of so my mouth. to have. And for the first time in a long time, you just live. You just live. Is what I mean? The, the, the like, last half an hour of this game. Totally. FPS. Jesus. Don't mention it. Has been. Quotes. <laughs> you really think I'll transform Haven? Of course. You already have. Oh. Your, your maybe music. all of that was like, this will happen if you stay, or this will happen if you travel, and now will give us the option. Maybe? But Alex, that doesn't mean you have to stay. Because we're obviously still here for now. You have the potential to do that anywhere you go. Do what? Oh, just smack the mic. What exactly? Become an actual musician? Live in a van? 
Travel between dingy bars, hawking your SoundCloud, <laughs> pouring your hawking your no 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 <laughs> no one uses SoundCloud anymore. Told to strangers. Sounds pretty good if you ask me. The truth is, there's no telling what that version of your future might be. Sorry, that the only name needs to die is the adventure. So. Yeah, here you what go. You now we get the option. Bang. Seek Adventure. I feel like if you pick Seek Adventure, there I might be I something want. in Double Exposure where you might cross paths with Max. Maybe. I just have that feeling. Obviously, there's a couple weeks to go into a... Uh, I think it's bang on a month until the game releases. Double exposure. Obviously, by the time this comes out on YouTube, it'll be out, I think. Or maybe the following. I think it's the following week it comes out. What's Ryan doing? Just admiring a bit. Oh, yeah, we would have left him. Here's what it is. Oh. Oh, never mind. I thought they were coming as well. Thank you. Not going to check our tickets or anything. Oh, her hand went through the bar. Did you see that? Maybe not because it was behind my camera. Hmm. But I saw it. And there's the mountain. Yeah, maybe. I just don't recall any of this episode, that's the thing. But maybe I did. Every day I want her back And she wants this penis But she's not getting my penis back. That's <laughs> a song she's gonna. <laughs> That's what she's gonna sing. I mean, there won't be a, a song. Oh, that's kind of cute. Oh, it's like different places we've gone and stuff, and maybe. Oh, Charlotte and Ethan. Hello, everyone. I'm Alex Chen. And you're listening to... She's not getting my penis back. <laughs> She's not... <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. And that is... Life is Strange, True Colors. Uh, soon, like I said a moment ago, Double Exposure is the next game in Life is Strange. That is coming out fairly soon. Episodes 1 and 2 should be out, I think, on release. Or at least for early access. I'm not too sure. Um, I'll have to double check that. Let's go see the stats. 44% of people hit the road to player music. 56% stayed in Haven. 31% uh, denounced Jed for his actions. So we said, nope, we do do not forgive you. Fuck off. 52% uh, of people claimed she learned not to fear her emotions. 83% some members of the council stood with Annex. 11% wanted to play her music in the future, which I managed to get a really low percentage there. Jesus. 65% didn't sit on the bed. 31% Ryan stood by Annex during the vote considering we haven't really given Ryan much affection in terms of the flowers and shit like that, he still stood by us, which is good. Uh, I double-clicked there, I think. No, I didn't. 4% Charlotte believed Annex but couldn't help. That's because we told her to actually sign the affidavit she got from Typhon, basically. 50-50, Eleanor sided with Annex during the vote. So I'm guessing because we... 
helped her out at the flower store, obviously when she was having her issues. Uh, she helped us back in this one. 74% Pike signed with Alex during the vote. So I'm guessing if you actually signed the affidavit from him, obviously from Typhon, but he kind of forced you, maybe not forced, but egged you on to sign it. Um, we didn't, so we got that one, I'm guessing. 54% uh, Ducky remained loyal to Jed. Fair enough, maybe if we uh, spoke to him a bit more, maybe he would have. 31% Moran believed Alex during the phone, which is not 69%. Um... 37% of Ryan and Alex don't go get together. Get it. 33% Seth and Alex leave Haven together. And that is Life is Strange True Colors.